Michelle and I are two very proud parents. We look at Olivia and just beam with proudness. Not only are you beautiful, but you are so sincere and a very special person, and no parent could ever love you more than we do at this moment. And the truth of the matter is, I didn't, I didn't really do anything and I didn't need to see you at all because you're a smart kid, you're a good hearted kid, you're a talented kid. And you didn't really need anything to get to where you are, where you are in life and where you are today with your beautiful bride. Kind of like a big brother, kind of like a dad. I'm incredibly proud of where you've got to now, don't cry. And you know, in a way, nothing makes me prouder than handing over the finished product. However you got there, um, to live. In the time that we have known Adam, he has just fitted in and very quickly become one of the gang. And together, as I think you'll all agree, they make a very special couple. In Olivia, you have found a very unique young lady. Not only is she beautiful, but spunky, and our little spitfire. There are no heights to her achievements, and there is nothing that ever phases her. She gives everything her all and never ceases to amaze us. All I can say is, Adam, that if she has chosen you, you must be a very special young man. All I can assure you is that you'll never have a dull moment and you're in for the ride of your life. I looked at you earlier and when I first saw you in your wedding dress and thought, where has my little girl gone? She looks just stunning and Adam is a very lucky fellow. I could never understand how anyone could be so certain, so sure of a relationship that early. And then I met you, Liv. My indescribably beautiful bride. My heart stopped when I saw you for the first time today. And every time I look at you now, I... Liv, I fell in love with you after four weeks and it took a bit of explaining from one of my friends what was going on, why I felt dizzy and lightheaded all the time. It took me a while to accept it and just stop trying to play it cool, which I was not good at. The Tabatzo. The Tabatzo. Kadat Moshev Israel. Israel. Yes. <laughs> <laughs>
of you are everything that I think we all dreamed of as a sister-in-law and as a wife for Adam. And I say that from the bottom of my heart. And I think there's not just the entire family that we're combining forces with. So we are very, very excited to have you as part of our team. So I will finish with a few promises. I can't promise you that everything is always going to be perfect. I can promise you that I will always do everything I can to make things as perfect as they can be. I can't promise I will never be angry or annoyed, but I can promise that I will always talk to you and always let you know what I'm thinking. And I can't promise I will always have the right answer. Based on past experience, I can guarantee that I won't nine times out of 10. But what I can promise and what I do promise is that I will always be there for you. Never wavering in my support, never changing in my loyalty, and never ending in my love for you. You are my everything. You're my babes. You're my Princess Olivia. You're my wife. And I love you.